What up, y'all? Welcome back to another Vintage Cube Draft Arena. This is an interesting pack. We have an Ulamog, which I personally love. We have an Animate Dead, which I personally love. We have a Woodfall thank Primus, you. which I personally love. Phil, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. 21 months. Closing in on two years. 500 bits if you 3-0 this strat. Wow, this is... The pressure is on now. Time Spiral volcanic island this pack is actually very good it's not it's not broken good but it's strong it's got some strength to it can we storm <sighs> be the be the thing you hate most in the world snap pick mana tithe i like ulamog because there's just so many ways to exploit it there's there's through the breach sneak attack uh there's not tooth and nail man tooth and nail bums me out that it's not in here Let's take Time Spiral and see what happens. Get Probe. Splinter Twin. Get Probe, though. Gotta take Get Probe, right? If we if we first pick it in Time Spiral, we gotta pick take a Get Probe. Also, I was playing with this lightsaber. This is a lightsaber from Galaxy's Edge. Oh, that's hilarious. It's a green it's a, it's a green kyber crystal in this, so you can't see it. Usually it's red. This is the one I made from Savi's workshop. But I bought a bunch of different ky kyber crystals to put in there. I've just been I've been really rejuvenated on the on the Star Wars hype train ever since the Mandalorian. Look at this dark ritual, cabal ritual, and lotus petal. Shut up and take I my money. Have a dark ritual light. Four storm <laughs> <laughs> Sammy, I appreciate you, buddy. I'm going to take the Dark Ritual, and I think one of these might come back. <sighs> Upheaval. Interesting. Oh, we're definitely all in on Storm here, for sure. I like Duress. I think we're Duressing here. I don't think we want Wandering Fumeral yet. Actually, maybe we do. I have not watched Star Wars Rebels, No. I also haven't watched Clone Wars, and I think those are next in our list. Like, uh, I know, I know they're both very, very good. I'm gonna take Wandering Fumeral. I think there is a part of us that definitely wants to have access to red in this, in this deck, because there's a million, um, you know, red rituals and things. So, Scarab God. A Gush is fine. It's not super impressive. Wishclaw Talisman is probably what we want here, right? Clone Wars will change your life for the better. Kitty, how dare you? Now you're just being insulting, Oral. As someone with children. Um... All right, it's already just good. Light up the stage could be fine. I don't think we're gonna be triggering it that much. Bolus of Citadel is that a thing? I mean, it's got to be a thing. I don't know if we're gonna play it in the main deck if we don't have more support for it, like Tinker, Mana Flare. Oh God! All right, we'll Mana Flare. He's four months. Have to wait till six till I show him Star Wars. That's that. That makes sense. Repeal is nice. Yeah, we'll take a repeal. Also, repealing our own mocks for free and then replaying it and drawing a card. That's the kind of combo world I want to live in. Um, Take Freebooter. Yeah, you can put Freebooter in the main deck. I'm fine with that. Lotus Bloom? Okay, sure. That's a playable. Repealing our own mocks, we'll get one. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about us. Cabal Ritual came back. As expected. 
this is the situation this is the situation like every blue black deck we've drafted so far where we get a bunch of these combo pieces like time spiral dark ritual probe and then we never get actual storm cards so then we have this literal horrendous deck that has absolutely no way to win with the cards we have and i feel like we've done that twice with blue black decks so far so you guys can check the the youtube vids for that hey light up the stage came back sure no red cards in the deck because we just don't need them yet. I don't foresee us having to get into the red. Yeah, that guy's fine. Dak Faden is very compelling reason to go into red. I think Bargain might come back. And Miscalc's fine. Yeah, we're just taking Dak here. Being able to just Dak is so good. There's a Tinker. There's a stupid Tinker. You stupid idiot Tinker. I don't think it's Past in Flames. I think Past in Flames is actually not great. I'm going to take the Tinker. Now we got Bor Bolas' Citadel, which is actually pretty good. It's a pretty good Tinker target. Also, if we get like a a Blightsteel or something, we'll definitely take that. There's a Brain Freeze. I think Brain Freeze is the, the second best one behind, uh, obviously, Tendrils. Brain Freeze is just rough because there's so many cards that shuffle back in, so... Oh, we passed the blight steel. Son of a biscuit. I don't think it's mere battlesphere. I think it's still brain freeze. Actually, it's probably high tide and brain freeze comes back. We're taking high tide here. Spire Bluff Canal is actually probably pretty good. I think Riffling Cloudskate is fine. Maybe we go off the turn we play Riffling Cloudskate? I don't think so. I think we just want the canal, especially with Dak Faden in the deck. Mine's a desire. We're gonna mine's desire. Uh, you play Storm without Past in Flames by playing Yawgmoth's Bargain instead. Kozilek. It's not a... It's not an artifact, so... Seething song, I'm taking a seething song. Do, 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 do. Charter Course? I like Charter Course. Alright, we have a bunch of pieces here. We just have to figure out... How, oh, there it is. There's the tendrils. So now we have Mind's Desire, tendrils, and brain freeze. No, we don't have brain freeze. But we still have Mind's Desire and tendrils, which is the which are the win conditions we need. All right. We just want a Mox and a, and a Lotus in the next pack. I don't think that's a lot to ask. Underworld Breach is not in the cube, no. There's the Yawgmoth's Bargain. We wanted to come back. I'm going to table the Tinker in the Citadel for now. I think our six drop should be bargain times borrow mind's desire. Looking for things like frantic search. We also want like all of the we did pass the volcanic island, which is rough. Yeah, past and flames came back anyway. Okay. Brain Freeze came back. Oh my goodness gracious. Firebolt? Sure, Firebolt's gotta be better than Agadim's Awakening here. We also have Mana Flare. We can play Mana Flare for sure. We just have to make sure it... Bone Shredders ready. Okay, so we didn't open the cards that we were looking for. Um, it was Black Lotus and several Moxes. They were not in this pack. So I think we're going to take Steam Vents. Frantic Search is great. It might come back. But I do want to... It's an island, so it works with, with High Tide, which is what we're looking for. We also want Water Grave or Underground Sea, which I don't think we've seen yet. So. Eh, this pack is not exciting for our... We have Lotus at home. <laughs> Lotus at home. Oh.
Okay, if nobody splash heartbeat. And we're not gonna be green instead. I think it's just coercive portal because it's just a solid card. Here's a thousand year storm for Chorwit. Is a thousand year storm any good in this deck? Maybe it's actually decent. I don't know if we're digging through time. To be quite honest, I might be able to make it work. Fact or fiction seems decent here. Days is good. We're not a metal worker deck, <laughs> that is for sure. Um, we didn't take the duress. We could take collective brutality. I'm gonna take fact or fiction. It's just good. Yeah, so we're drawing up here. Dark Petition is probably fine. Impulse? Oh, let's take a oh, Desperate Ritual or a Brawl. I think it's Brawl. Yeah, it's got to be Brawl here. None of these are great. It's probably just Brazen Borrower. Yeah, I think we came a little short here without Yogmoth's Bargain. Or Yogmoth's Will, rather. Oh, a thousand, thousand year storm bits from Chorwit himself. I'm going to take Chain Lightning because I think we're trying a thousand year storm here. I'm going to take Lightning Strike for the same reason. Dig Through Time coming back was really something I hoped for. Especially with Factor Fiction. Uh, I'm just going to take Metal Worker so no one else can have it because they don't deserve it. I think they might have fixed the... Oh, Desperate Ritual came back? Oh my god. We have no black fixing, though, which is unfortunate. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know if we can cut the black, though. Swamp fixes for black? <laughs> huh. Well... I suppose that's true. Like, we just don't have enough cards to cut black, unfortunately. This is 7, so we go to 21. We could actually put Light Up and Firebolt. It's just hard because Cabal Ritual and Dark Ritual are very, very good. Um... We can cut Bargain. I think these three are good. Cut Repeal. We don't have any great combos with Repeal. Cut Kite Sail. Brazen Bar was kind of meh. I think this could work with one more cut. I kind of like this, actually. This is not terrible. We shall see. Maybe it's Wishclaw Talisman because we have Dark Petition already. I actually, I'd rather have Petition than Wishclaw because it, uh, it triggers Thousand Year Storm. And the odds of us Shut triggering the Spell money. Mastery is very high. Dinner time, Buck. Sammy, have a good night, buddy. Thank you for the support, my dude. Really appreciate you. Okay, so we're by color. Okay, so we're definitely 7, 8, 9, 10. This is 8. I want 6. So there's 10, 5, 4, 5, 6, 7. So this is 6, 6. And then 8. I think we're going to go 7, 7, 
seven seven six. It's not the best. Don't forget the Nomad. Are you talking about Yorion? Because <laughs> I'm going to definitely forget that guy. All right, we're going to save this. Oh, High Tide might not be good enough, actually. What do we have, like five? Yeah, High Tide might not actually make the cut, unfortunately. We only have like five lands that High Tide cares about. That's That's true. Yeah, that's that's pretty brutal. Oh, I definitely don't want Citadel over Thousand Year Storm. I think Thousand Year Storm is very good with like Chain Lightning, Lightning Strike. Like if we can go Dark Ritual, Cabal Ritual, Seething Song, Chain Lightning, Lightning Strike, like they're just dead. If we happen to have all five of those cards in our hand, like what can they do? <laughs> But, I mean, the point is, like, there's definitely combinations of cards that can snowball out of control. And Kerwit loves Thousand Year Storm, so we're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna Thousand Year Storm for him. I'll probably, I'll probably just Brazen Bar, actually. I think Brazen Bar is probably better than Repeal. Man. No High Tide is rough, but we gotta be realistic. Conjecture is also not bad, actually. Doubling our spells is pretty sweet. Hearing is a combo with all the swamps you have. It, it has th three generic mana and swamps make that. That's true, actually. It's also a combo with two of the islands I have. I wonder if we want conjecture over like brain freeze. I don't feel like I want I care about brain freezing. I guess I think I think most of the time brain freezing is fine. Why do these matches take so long to fire? And we did it. My hair doesn't exist. Uh, oof, oof. Oh boy. I'm going to keep it. Oh god. If we chop the top like a lotus bloom, this hand is actually the bee's knees. We did not. We did not top deck a lotus bloom. Maybe Magic Online is struggling to find another Storm deck for you to play against round one. You know, maybe. They did find us the Grixis Mirror match, though. Um, three, four. That, could, that doesn't do it yet, huh? Okay. So next we have five mana. Multi kicker for one. Interesting. Gotta keep those counter spells up. All right. No. All right.
I've become the thing I've hated with the storm deck. <sighs> what can you do? We definitely want more lands, that's for sure. What's happening right now? Five mana. Six mana. That's a guy. That is a guy. All right. What do we do here? Can we win? <laughs> Oh, can we wait here? I don't know. To do. We can Dark Ritual into Thousand Year Storm. Hope they don't have a response. Way to deal with it. We would take 10. Okay. We could also go Dark Ritual Tendrils of Agony for 4. I think that's probably winning play. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We can go Dark Ritual Lightning Strike Tendrils for 9. We gain six. I don't know how we lose that. I really kind of want to keep the Dark Ritual, but I don't see how we're going to do that. I feel like we just have to run Thousand Year Storm out there. But it seems terrible. Actually, if we hit a... L we have two turns is the problem. Like, this guy attacks for ten, then they kill us. So... Unfortunately, Ritual into Thousand Year Storm doesn't give us... I think we just have to do it. <laughs> Alright. Your move. They're gonna. They're just going to Brazen Bar with us. Oh god, they're going to do something worse. Oh Jesus, what is happening? Frost Titan? They're going to Frost Titan and tap down one of our lands. Oh boy. It's going to be real weird if we just happen to lose to Grave Titan, Frost Titan, and nothing else. I am dead inside. Hmm. Come on, Gataxian Probe and a spell we can cast. Okay. This costs five now, huh? Okie dokie. Yeah. That was a good game. It's a good game. Good, 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 good. <laughs> nice deck butt munch. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was... That was a thing. That was a thing. This is how I feel about Storm sometimes. Like, sometimes you just... It just you miss, like, the, the main... Like, I'm missing, like, a bargain instead of a... I keep saying bargain. A Yogmas Will instead of a stupid Past in Flames. What up, Team J, bro? <sighs> what if you had Yorion that game? Ah, oh, what a different game that would have been. Yeah, you know, I wouldn't have been able to cast Yorion because I only had one blue source on. No, I actually had, I had two blue sources. I could have cast Yorion. Um, with the... That instead of casting uh, Past in Flames. Team Jabro, all right, buddy. 
pretty all right. Our opponent is figuring out how to board against Bad Storm, so. <laughs> I still wake up every morning happy Trump lost. Same. Same. It's funny because he just loses every day, too, so it's really weird. It's very weird to just keep losing every day, to just insist that I'm just going to be a loser every single day. But, you know, to each their own, I guess. What's the hold up here? Are they literally just taking all of their sideboarding time? This is This is wild. Okay, this is a hand. And we're on the play. Oh, we're living the dream. They are taking they're taking a little boop. Yeah, they didn't want to they didn't want to gamble on whether I was going to bring Yorion in, so Is Dark Ritual free now? So free. Hashtag free dark ritual. This guy's just going to get in there. That's wild. I'm almost tempted to dark ritual in the course of portal here, but... I'm going to play a land because if they have miscalculation or okay fascinating we could go this into this into how much mana does that give us so we got one two three four use one of it go to six use three of it replay tendrils or replay cabal replay ritual it's one two three four five six seven hmm. it's very close <clears throat> very close <laughs> Ooh, they've done nothing again. And we're just going to play Portal here, so... <clears throat> that resolved, huh? All right. Still nothing. This is very strange. Okay, let's suspend this guy. Play this guy. Opponent, this is not how you play cube. I don't understand what's going on personally, but. So again, we can go one, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight. I think this might be good enough, right? Three, six, past in flames. We don't have another red, though. We need a second red. I mean, they're welcome to hold counter spells when we have coercive portal in play, so. What's happening right now? Uh, sh sure, that's unfortunate, but. It's fine. fucking annoying two games in a row huh seems good So what are they at? 13? Can we just kill them here? So we got this is gonna cost four. One, two, three, four. We can go ritual tendrils. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six. One. When does this come down? Two turns. It's a good amount of time. We can also chart a course here. <clears throat> One, two, three, four. We go regular ritual, cabal ritual, chart a course. One, two, three, four, five, five. I think we're close, but we're not there yet. This is just getting terrible. Yep. All right. One one turn left, huh? Does that do anything? One, two, three. Next turn it might. One, two, three. We have Lotus. We can go one, two, three, four, five, six. We don't get to untap anything. <clears throat> I kind of just want to play it here and see what the worst they can do is. They already have six mana. Is giving them 12 mana that bad? I don't know. Maybe. Should we drop it? Yes, it's that bad, or yes, we should drop it. That's these are the questions. <clears throat> yeah, we'll just play it next turn after we uh, after Lotus resolves. It can't really get that much worse. I mean, it can, and we we definitely have a chance to win next turn.
Yep, that's fine. <clears throat> All right, let's see if this resolves. Oh, let's not do that. We didn't even draw a card yet. <clears throat> oh, that's a good one. All right, I think we could probably do this. Mana fart. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. If they counter this, we're just dead, though, right? Oh, they didn't counter that. Okay, we just win the game. Wow! <laughs> That's okie dokie. Alrighty then. Wow. What are they doing over there? If someone exiles your graveyard in that situation, is it a bajuka buck or a bukajuka ball? <laughs> These are the hard questions. You're really asking the hard hitting questions here. Hmm. <clears throat> Kind of like Yawgmoth's Bargain in the deck, but I think we're actually probably okay. All right. <clears throat> Interesting. I mean, I know Probe is supposed to be a uh, Thief, Rakdos, Everflowing Chalice. Okay. Deal. That's actually not terrible for us. <coughs> yep, you got it. So you played Mountain Rakdos Siggy. Also with Past in Flames, them hitting us with Thief of Sanity could be just fine. Swamp. And Thief without using Rakdos Siggy? <clears throat> yep, you got it. Look, they used the Racto Signet correctly. I probably would have played Everflowing Chalice for one and then played it, but, you know, to each their own. Is there a benefit to casting this now? <clears throat> yes, because then we can actually play it next turn if we really want to. 
Which I think we do. Three, four. <clears throat> I don't know what this is. Ah, oh, boy. Glory bear. Sure. Well, I don't think we're playing that yet. <clears throat> Chain Lightning, huh? Can that win us the game? Hmm. Interesting. The answer is no. So if we go Seeding Song, Chain Lightning, Past in Flames, Git Probe, Seeding Song, Chain Lightning, Brain Freeze... One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's 21 cards, and there are 29 cards. Not good. We're definitely missing some key components to this storm deck, but I mean that's how that's how it goes. So go into ten. On the bright side, if they cast their own chain lightning, we can copy it. Yep. Duretti. Mom's spaghetti. <clears throat> Dak Faden is actually pretty interesting here. I think we chain lightning this, play Dak Faden, steal the Rakdos signet. I mean, they can always sack their construct to kill the Rakdos signet. They'd have to see that line, though. <clears throat> I'm going to steal this because I don't know if they're going to see it. I don't know if they're going to care about it. <clears throat> Digging with that seems worse because this takes their second black source and it also, two cards is not huge. We definitely care about it. Mana is super relevant and oftentimes can be the bottleneck in the in the storm deck. I feel like we only need like one good card here. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll have seven mana next turn. Okay. <clears throat> well, they did kill it.
They went face? Oh my god. That's very fascinating. <clears throat> oh wow. This is wild. Does Mana Flare do it for us? I haven't seen Time Spiral once yet. Um, one, two, three. We go Seething Song. One, two, three, man of flare. Let's see what we got going on for us now. <clears throat> All right. Blue and black. I don't think this is going to do it, but it's five, six mana. Five, six, seven, eight mana. We can pass for four. Okay. <clears throat> Mountain. All right. One, two, three, four. Yep. This is not. We're 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 basically dead. I think. Uh, we can dig. We can dig, but we'd have no blue left. We don't have enough black left. One, two, three, four, five. Can we activate DAC again? No. Okay. Sounds good. Six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'd leave one card in the graveyard. Or we'd have one mana, rather. So this has to be just better. But we don't have enough. We actually can't play this and dig. That's pretty unfortunate. Um, yeah. And now we're dead on board. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's the time spiral we needed. Yep, all right. We tried. <clears throat> what can you do? <clears throat> Sometimes you don't hit. I mean, that's the that's definitely the price you pay with Storm, you know. All right. Um, yeah, you know, a red or a black is fine. I can complain about it on the internet all day. This time I think we're good oh boy oh we did it oh that's the best that's exciting uh oh is this mono red it feels mono ready what are the odds this this barrel sticks around though feels low All right. Well. Okay. <clears throat> they hit a Bomad Courier, so now they play their land, and then they play the Bomad Courier. This is actually a pretty decent... This is decent, though, because now we can block pretty much everything they have. Yeah, they didn't attack there. That's great. It's obviously not Mono Red. Figure of Destiny is a White Red card. Dang. Wish I wasn't so stupid. All right, we're just going to pass here because that's how you do when you got the triple blue. Would love to have lightning strike, but 
that's okay. Yeah, you know, that's okay. What, what, what can you do, you know? Uh, I think we're probably blocking Bomi here. Big Bomes. Oh, but then they get to... No, they don't. Maybe they do. Sure. Okay, they're actually not <clears throat> going to Rashad and Port Me, which is just great. I like that. All right. Hmm. We need red and black. That's the real pain in the ass here. So we got, we got so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We can just brainstorm for funsies. I mean, dark petitioning for a mountain is literally an option that we have. This costs four, but nets us three. So it basically costs one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We go down to seven here. Get a mountain. The problem is we want to brain freeze first just to get it out of the way. Otherwise, we're not getting the three. Right, I know. That's why I'm trying to say. That's why I'm. That's why we're talking about brain freezing here. I feel like we have to do something though. And this costs five, so we can actually go brain freeze, mind's our lightning strike. This is one, two, three, four, five. This is like a, this is actually a pretty decent. Um... All right, we're gonna do it. Five. Brain freeze you. Um, we have two in there. We can dark petition to get a red source. Um, against this deck, I probably just want mountain, right? So this is four, five, six, seven. This is five. This is one. We can... Oh, what up, Moochel B? Kill that guy. Five, six, one, two, three for six. All right, let's see what we hit here. Dark Ritual. Desperate Ritual. Swamp. Land. Seething Song. Git Probe. Uh, you got Colagon, Hazaret, Land. Yep, that was a fucking whiff. That's really sad. <laughs> if we were able to keep the brain freeze, uh, we would have been able to, to do it. Wow, what a sad little whiff, though. Yeah, that's that's pretty brutal. If we had one blue floating instead of the one black, I think this would be a different game. Because then we could either we can still play Dak Faden, discard Brace Mars, still find something maybe. Um, their hand is Colagon's command Hazaret, so they're gonna play Hazaret and land, and they should be able to attack us. I don't actually think we're gonna. I mean, having these in the graveyard is just better, but I really don't think it's gonna make a difference. So sad. So sad, dude. Alright. <sighs> Here's the land. I mean, if they draw one mana spell, they can, they can attack with Hazard. They have Colagon Scan, but no black, so we know that these two cards exist. Uh, 
They just played that guy? Sure. Yep. Okie dokie. Hmm. Let's get rid of Lotus Bloom, Cabal Ritual, Lightning Strike, Dark Petition, and probably Mind's Desire. <clears throat> All right, we can get a... Definitely getting a Swamp here. Does Chain Lightning do anything? It kills this guy. It's not terrible. We're going to probably bounce one of these things. I almost want two lands here. is pretty good. I mean, I'm thinking we're just taking eight here and seeing what happens. Take, taking seven, we'll go to one and we'll see what happens. We cannot play Brazen Barber. So Steam vents, huh? Oh, that's got to be good. Deck, fade, and of course we draw. <laughs> okay. Sounds good. <laughs> All right. Well, not ideal. Let's bring in Languish. Let's bring in Bone Shredder. Firebolt. Take out Brazy B. Eh, Brazy B's probably fine. Take out Thousand Year Storm. I think it's probably too slow here. Take out... Repeal might be fine. Okay, we have to stop with the Yorion memes. It's getting a little excessive now. Um... Maybe Course of Portal as well. They have Coligon's Command. I think we just play 41 here. Uh, I think it's a little slow for Thousand Year Storm. Yep, this hand is pretty rough. One blue, I think it's okay though. So, I don't know. Our mana base is pretty rough. I would much rather a far more blue centric deck, but uh, unfortunately, it was not there. Thank you. The Gaming Champ. Thank you for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. It's almost two and a half years, my dude. Really appreciate it. Okay. Okay. Well, that's a start. We just need a swamp. Can a dude just get a, a second swamp? Even more of that, they could have a bit of black and green, right? I, I don't know what you're talking about, Mark. I have no idea what you mean. Firebolt? Well, biscuits. Wow. 
Well, that's unfortunate. I'm not going to bank on getting a second black anytime soon. Walking Ballista for two. Okay. This is really annoying. I really don't think our mana is that terrible. <laughs> like, 776? Seven, seven, like, come on. You know what? Sure. Okay, Flame Slash Mountain. Oh, cool. All right, cool. Couldn't hit a fourth land in six turns. Sounds good, even when they have Goblin Guide in play. Well, let's try to one two. This is why I don't. This is why I don't like drafting decks like this. They're very, very reliant on having to draw very, very specific cards. And this is why I lean towards mid range decks in a cube of all things because I like having answers and threats, and I like being able to respond to things and also present present pressure so we're i mean like these decks are fun every now and then and, and there are definitely people who are fantastic at drafting them uh i admittedly am not one of them Okay, okay. Mm, okay. I'm a maniac. Boo -doo -doo -doo. Shut up and take my money. Oh. Draw all the cards. I don't care how you win, but you better draw a lot of cards. Oh, wow, that sounds perfect. That sounds like the exact thing I want to do. Kerwit, thank you, buddy. I love you, my dude. Oh, man. I just want you to draw a lot of cards. Sounds good. Well, if you're twisting my arm. <laughs> Let me write this bad boy down. Have to get going. Have a good day. And if I don't see you before the end of the year, unforgiven. Have a happy new year, buddy. Thank you for all the support this year. Really appreciate you. And I hope you have a great one. And hopefully I will see you before then. But if not, I hope you have a great one. Good old Chorwit. Ooh, old hunty boy. So... Seething song into a thousand year storm, huh? Hmm. Does that do anything? Should we just play this? If we just play this, they might flip this. But you know what? We're going to wait because if we don't draw anything, yeah, see, I just want to play this now. And if they want to flip it, that's fine, because then we can just get to play Thousand Year Storm.
How many steps steps are in the queue? Um, a couple. Um, one, two, three, about four right now. Okay, that's pretty good. Don't really want to have to deal with that. But what choice what choice have we? Well, we're definitely chumping here. Oh, we can't? Wait, why? Because it can't block ever. Okay, that's a good reason. It's just not able to block. It doesn't do that. That's not a thing it does. You know what I mean? <clears throat> One, two. Yeah, we're definitely getting rid of the red here. You know what would be cool? Languish. You know what's in our sideboard? Languish. Only borrows, no blocks. Oh, man. Can't you just come down for like, I don't know, five minutes? Why did they kill that? That's so weird. Oh, wow, I can just steal this sword. But it doesn't unequip it, right? Yeah, that's no good. It does indeed stay equipped. So we can discard Swamp. We can play Thousand Year Storm here. Uh, we would we would get that whenever equipped creature does combat damage to a player, that player discards a card, and we untap all of our lands. So we'd still have to discard a card. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't seem worth it. I think we just slam Thousand Year Storm because we have it and we're able to do so. And we can discard Swamp. And then we can hope we don't, like, they're just going to kill it, right? They're just going to, they're just going to Assassin's Trophy it because they're haters. Boo-doo-doo-doo. <sighs> Cool, cool, cool. Sometimes it's almost too easy. Four, five, six. So we're not dead. I guess they play nothing and flip this guy. Oh, wow. Mm, boy. That's interesting. Less interesting now that we don't have Thousand Year Storm. Being able to go Seething Song into Double Chain Lightning into Triple Lightning Strike. 9, 6, 15. Still wouldn't do anything. <laughs> but it's fun to dream. Uh, we can just wait here. This makes it so they can't flip their guy if they don't play anything.
Remember that time I said they were going to Assassin's Trophy the Thousand Year Storm and that was the literal exact thing they did? That sounds good. Seems okay. Goodbye, wandering fumeral. Goodbye, deck. I actually don't. I think, like, Time Spiral is the only card we can draw here that even gives us a remote chance. And it's very remote. And we have not drawn Time Spiral one time in this entire set of games. So, six six matches, no Time Spiral. Bring in Languish. Take out Chain Lightning. I think Thousand Year Storm is just too slow. It's really making me sad, but... It's just not doing what we want. Did we distant? We 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 two under our first, and now we're about to o three this with this storm deck that that you guys all talked me into. It's okay, no one talked me into. There's the time spiral. We did it. I will keep it. And I'll put past in flames on the bottom. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and no blue mana because, you know, there has to be equilibrium. <laughs> it's, it's true. It's true. Hey, look at that. No land. Okay. Well, my play skill is really shining here. But the, uh, you know, the lack of land draws here, so. Land? Oh, wow, that was the best land we could have asked for. Unfortunately, we can't steal this guy. But I can. Shred his bones. Go to the garbage can, little centaur man. And they're going to draw a sword of Feast and Famine with nothing on board. Guys, maybe we're still alive. Oh my god, not his bones. Yes. His bones. Wait, what? This is so weird when they kill the bone shredder. 
I'm like, buddy, I have no intention of paying for that. I guarantee you. I assure you that dude is not getting paid for. I'm just going to pass here. I'm not going to Desperate Ritual, Mana Flare, or Dak Faden at this particular juncture. Although land into sword is pretty rough. Maybe they miss a land drop. Maybe another player in the game of Magic the Gathering misses... Jesus Christ. I am dead inside. Do you kill the Wandering Funeral or the single black source? That's better than we were hoping because we want that second black to languish. Come on, black source. There's a lot of you in the deck. It's not impossible. It's fucking impossible. I will dig so hard and so fast. Um, gotta pitch flare, right? We're so close to time spiraling here. Actually, one, two, three. I think it's dig and I think it's dig and languish. Like, we need another land in order to time spiral Mana Flare next turn, but we might not. We might not, because we can go Cabal Ritual, Mana Flare. Yep, had a feeling you'd do that. What I tell you about yuppers? <laughs> Told me not to, not to say it. Wait, what? Post combat. Interesting. Oh my god, yes. Living that dream. Living that dream. So one, two, three. Yeah, we go writ. Use this for Mana Flare. This for Cabal writ. One, two, three, four, five, six. And Time Spiral will keep another black in there. One, two, three, four, five. This is not the best, especially when Dark Petition does not get us anything. But, one, two, three, four. Do we play land? Yes, we did. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're at Storm Counts four. I mean, this is just an easy choice. Five. This is going to be six. That's 18 cards. I don't think that does it. Brain Freeze ourselves seems interesting. So, if we do Brain Freeze ourselves, we could potentially hit... Can we Mind's Desire here? It's three, four, five, one, two. We definitely can. We can also Brain Freeze first. Or Brain Freeze. Let's Dark Petition. We'll see what happens. One, two. Yeah, let's go get a Mind's Desire. And then we'll keep Brain Freeze for last. Mind's Desire, one, two, three, four, five, six. 
Mind's Desire for seven. And if it, at least like three of them are spells, we should be fine. We should actually get them. Okay, that's a good one. That's not. That's a good one. That's not. That's a good one. That's not. And that's not. Okay, so cast this guy. Cast this guy for Freezels. Cast Fact or Fliction. Oh, there's a Tendrils? <laughs> That'll do, right? Do we finally just storm off? Tell me it feels good. We don't we have black mana, we have a lotus bloom. We literally just we literally just played it. That'll do. He's like, I don't want to choose. They're like, I, I just have no desire to to split these piles. Some dogs floating around behind me. I really like this deck wants a signature too. You can't eat cats, Kevin. You can't eat cats. I'm gonna mulligan this hand. One land is not all we want. This is better. <sighs> Dark Ritual. Mana Flare, eh? Okay. I'll feed cats. It's true. <laughs> That's just so much worse than anything else. Cats should get revenge and eat Alf. It's getting dark. <laughs> Hunt Master of the Falls. It's Fells, but I wanted to say Falls. I don't know why, but we did it anyway. Oh, Season Pyromancer? Eh. Eh, if we can draw Black Black, it might be okay, because then eventually we're going to be able to go Mana Flare into Mind's Desire. Storm for two. It's just so good. It's going to be a Lotus Bloom, though. So It's going to be a Black? All right. I want to just bolt this gentleman. Oh no. No, don't like that. Give me another black source so I can kill these guys. Oh god. Don't I have two cards in hand? 
Yeah, they're gonna eat that firebolt immediately. Yep, that's that's good. That's very good. Well, that's not what we're looking for here. But next turn we can go mana flare into languish. This guy might be too big at that point though. Have you seen the new channel prediction stuff on Twitch? Yes, I don't know how to enable it though, and I haven't looked into it at all. So. Well, there's only two creatures to eat, but. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> For some reason, I thought when they ate our Firebolt, it was going to give it plus one, plus one. I, I don't know. It did not. Okay, they are eating their acidic slime, and. Oh, they did the EOT. Got it. I was like, what did they tap out for? I understand now. Yep, that's going to be harder. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We go to eight. We languish. We go to three, and they have one card in hand. Why can't Languish just be Damnation right here? Yeah, if it was to get plus one, plus one for me to get anything, it would be a little bit broken. This is kind of funny. <laughs> the days. The days you eat the biscuits in the morning, I guess. I mean, we just have to do this or else we're dead, so... Next turn, what we what do we want to hit? Best thing to hit, probably. One, two, three, four. Factor fiction? No, I don't know. It says Danguish destroys all bleachers, obviously. Well, if it was an instant, that'd be sweet too, but then they could actually eat another. No, they couldn't. And then we take one, but now we're taking five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Time spiral will be very good, yes. I'm hoping they just have nothing in the last two cards. That's that's my hope. Just let me take five. Don't do anything with your stupid mana. Get your seasoned pyromancer out of the graveyard. You know what? Do that. That's boring. And then I get one last turn before my, my O3 concludes and I get my 10 play points. It was a good run, though. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Here we go. I'll use my one time of 2020. Okay. I think they actually overpaid as well because they forgot about... Just kidding. They didn't forget about anything. <laughs> Uh, boy, it's always amazing how they always have fucking the, the one answer they need on the one turn they need it. That's really incredible. <laughs> cool. Yep. Cool. Oh, Mind's Desire. Can you can you Mind's Desire into a into a time twister or a time spiral? Mm. Four. It's nothing. You know what? I literally have nothing left to live for. Sure. <laughs> there it is. Hey, we found it. Cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Be sure to send your, your support monetarily or subscription-wise uh, over to my, my Twitch channel to, to pay your respects for this fucking absolutely horrendous storm deck that just wasn't meant to exist. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for, thanks for watching.